Can you please take me home before you knock me down? In the heart of South Africa's festive season, where celebrations echo with joy, a quick video unfolds, capturing the essence of a beloved brew, Carling Black Label. With a spirited toast, friends gather to revel in the merriment as the distinctive red label of Carling Black Label takes center stage. Originating from the brewing traditions of Canada, this lager, introduced in 1927, has been a steadfast companion in the hands of beer enthusiasts. With an alcohol volume ranging between 5 to 5.5 percent, it carries the legacy of Carling Brewing Company, a name synonymous with quality. Delving into the brewery's history, Carling has been crafting lagers since the 1870s, a testament to its enduring commitment to the art of brewing. In a transformative move in 1927, under the leadership of J. Innes Carling, the black and white lager was rebranded to the iconic black label, setting the stage for a global journey. Enter E.P. Taylor, a Toronto business tycoon whose acquisition of Carling paved the way for black label to make history. It became the first beer brewed on a mass international scale, winning the hearts of beer aficionados in the United Kingdom, Australia, New Zealand, and the celebratory landscape of South Africa. As the video unfolds, sip by sip, it's not merely a drink, it's a voyage through time, culture, and the shared joy of festivities. So, whether you're in the company of friends or enjoying a quiet moment, Carling Black Label stands as a timeless brew, weaving stories that span continents and generations. Cheers to the legacy of Carling Black Label, a beer that transcends borders and unites beer lovers worldwide in the spirit of celebration.